Welcome back to another Horizon. It's like part 14 or something now. This is a long game. Last time we got in this cave and it thought we were Elizabeth Elizabeth Sobeck. Who's a doctor or something, so. Yeah, we gotta figure out who this is. Wait, wait, wait. 350,000. That's hundreds of years ago. What's going on? Yo. Did she say 350th floor? I think this Elizabeth is your, your mom in this game. Do I gotta make it jump or am I going down? This place is cool. I like it. It gives it. It's like giving me destiny, destiny vibes. They have handrails for safety, but then they just have a. With over 25,000 human employees based in nations and corporate holdings across the globe, Pharaoh leads the world in every wait, sector wait, wait, wait. of self-sustaining, fully automated technology. From revolutionary consumer products to... What was this place? What were they doing here? Uh, I think... A group of people not on like a drug. And they made machines. Yeah, go on. I've uploaded some data files to your focus. They'll help you understand. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, that's what I was about to say, though. Like, I think they was working on the machines. Kind of like in uh, Mason or whatever. Where they like created the whole thing, but then it like it got messed up. Now I know this must seem like a bizarre change in direction. I mean, we're Faro Automated Solutions, right? Number one robotics firm in the world. Why would we clear our production slate to fabricate human-operated vehicles and weapon systems, the relics of the past? All I can say at this juncture is. Trust me, we will be exploiting a massive Take a minute uh, to think about that. growth opportunity by retooling and reallocating capacity according to my plan. So I will need revised projections of mass fabrication. So they were making machines, then they stopped to make other kinds of weapons. Why? Dang, this is only like a hundred feet and it's taken me a long time. Oh, oh, chill. Damn, what happened? Looks like I can climb here. Oh, wait. What's down here then? Oh, that is a machine. I could, uh, yeah, I could climb here, but for why? Oh, I could jump to that. Yes, sir. I also <coughs> bet you I might be able to. Oh. I can use that as a ramp to get back up. Never mind. To get back up? It, it, why does she want me to go back up? I don't know how. Maybe I missed something over here. I'm a little confused. <sighs> like how... Is that really it right there? It really wants me to like do that. Like... Really? No, go back. Wow, I'm really stupid. Get out of this. <sighs> Finally. Wow, that 
that was not an obvious thing for me for some reason. Yeah, they said there were 350 levels or something like that. If plants so. can find a way to hang on up here, I guess I can too. Alright. Uh, I wouldn't be so sure about now. Plants are a lot cooler than you, so. Frost on my eyelashes. That's not even. You literally just. It's not, it's not even... Excuse me? Since it began when they engaged in unauthorized offensive operations against robots and human personnel of the Hearts Timor Energy Combine. Yeah, I didn't hear the last one, so that that's doesn't, that's not going to make any sense to me. They were built for war, not peace. Wait, I want to see something. Really? You made the tip of the arrow ice, but you, it's still on fire. What? The way up. All it takes is a few good handholds. I thought they were gonna make me walk on the edge. Alright, made it. Should I take a leap of faith? There's a save point, right? I'm gonna do it. Look, you can see the ground. Won't get where I'm going this time. <gasps> Dang! That data has been erased from this device. Do you wish to deploy our privileges to recover much data? Oh yes, I believe I do. Elizabeth, good to, uh, it's been years. Where's your legal team, Ted? No need. I dropped all 18 lawsuits the moment you landed. I assume your daddy confirms this. I don't see the resemblance. All right, this promises to be interesting. Perhaps we could have lunch brought in. You know, get reacquainted. I know you, Ted. You've screwed something up, something big, or you wouldn't have the crow necessary to get me here. So spit it out. There's a glitch in the chariot line. You're a killer robot? Peacekeepers, yes. Those. So shut them down. <laughs> Obviously, Liz, we would if we could. They're not responding. Are you telling me a swarm has gone rogue, Ted? It's worse than that. <sighs> Show me the data then. And I'll take that lunch. Alone. Hmm. Ted Faro brought Elizabeth Sobek here. But they hated each other. Some of the fun has been recovered. This isn't a glitch. It's a catastrophe. Fully aware. It's bad. Bad? Jesus, Liz. It's 
not bad, Ted. It's apocalyptic. You built a line of killer robots. Peacekeepers. That consume biomass as fuel. In emergencies. And you made them capable of self-replication. Limited, self-manufacture, controlled. Not anymore. The glitch severed chain of command. The only nation this swarm answers to now is itself. You, you think I... Everything else is just food. And at the rate it's replicating, Ted, it will strip the Earth bare in 15 months. We're not talking the fall of civilization. We're talking extinction. I get it, Liz. So how do I stop it while it's contained? It's not contained. It can't be. You know what I mean. Right. Before the truth gets out, you mean. Liz, I will do anything you say. Keep working it, and whatever you recommend, I'll do. I'm gonna hold you to that, Ted. Hmm. The robots threatened all life on Earth. But somehow she defeated them. The world of the old ones fell, but life went on, or we wouldn't be here. Project Zero Dawn. Jesus, Liz. There has to be another way. If there were a nicer way to fix your mess, I would have proposed it. But this? This? When I asked you to find a cure, I didn't expect it to be worse than the disease. It's not, Ted. It may be grim. But it's our only chance. Now sign the proposal. Sign it? I can't sign that. Yes, you can. That? Liz, I cannot in good conscience sign that. You've got then a you choice, could Ted. Create a killer robot. I know. I am speaking to you from a VTOL en route to US Robot Command. In 15 minutes, I meet with General Harris and the rest of the Joint Chiefs. What? what? Are you crazy? Now your choice is what I tell them. Sign, and I'll tell them the wealthiest corporation on Earth has guaranteed Didn't the funds necessary to build Zero Dawn. Exactly as I've designed it. Or don't sign, and I will make sure they and everyone else on this planet knows the real cause of the glitch. Jesus, Liz. You don't have to threaten me. She's I'll literally sign. standing in a table. Look on the bright side, Ted. From here on out, you get to do what you've always been good at. Footing the bill while others get their hands dirty. God forgive me. Do it. Sign it. Oh. What made her solution so terrible? What Destroy the Earth, problem. Executive access detected. Express lift Expre Express lift, really? I couldn't have took that up here. This, this doesn't add up. Sobek couldn't have been my mother. She lived ages ago. All this searching, and I'm so. I mean, no people closer. live pretty long. What's your reaction to everything you've just learned? To whine like a spoiled child? You should really try talking that way to me face to face. As you wish. Do you really have no idea how monumental are the discoveries you just made, Aloy? I expected more of you. So, Shut your hands, sir. you have a face. Got a name to go with it? Of all the questions you could ask right now, that's the one you choose. I've spent decades searching the ruins of the older ones, trying to solve the mystery of what happened to them. For years, I've suspected that feral robots destroyed their civilization, but I could never confirm it. And in minutes, you uncover more ancient knowledge than I have in a lifetime. And what you want to know is my name. Yes. Silence. That's my name. Now, why don't you try asking another question? Something less trivial. Whatever. All right, silence. You've made your point. I came to these ruins hoping to learn more about this Elizabeth Sobek. And I have, but I still...
still don't understand my connection to her. Or why the Eclipse is trying to kill me. Or who Hades is. No answers, just one question after another. Exactly. Which is why it's time to expand your frame of inquiry. Only then will you see just how big your problems really are. What exactly are you talking about? You've chased a personal riddle into a crowd of larger mysteries. The common thread is your connection to Elizabeth Subic. But what is that connection? She couldn't have been my mother if she lived centuries ago. We don't know the connection yet. The only way to find out is to keep going, to keep making discoveries. Thanks to you, we've only just now learned that Pharaoh robots once threatened to end life on Earth. But it didn't happen. The Old One civilization was destroyed, but life... Life was saved. Obviously. So, what did Elizabeth do? How did she stop the robots before all was lost? What was Project Zero Dawn? Exactly the question. Now, are you ready to go get the answer? Of course I am. Then why are you still standing here? Not so fast, Silence. You've got some explaining to do. I've told you quite enough. If you've still got questions, be quick about it and stop wasting my time. Is there any chance... It's highly unlikely, but not impossible. Some of the ancient data I've recovered includes mentions of life extension techniques. Pharmaceuticals, what? mostly. An ancient word for medicine. But some were still trying to perfect ways of freezing and unfreezing people. Freezing and unfreezing people? That's literally what I thought. Cryogenics, they called it. But there were problems with it. Given Elizabeth's technological acumen, I can't definitively rule out that she found a way to make herself immortal. But this is speculation. Wasting time. Now that's enough talking. Oh no. I'm just getting started. You've been getting a free ride on my focus, risking nothing while I risk everything. All I have to do is take this thing off my head, and you'll be blind, deaf, and dumb. So quit complaining, and answer my questions. Very well. Uh, actually, Elizabeth I don't told ask Ted Faro she was headed for a place called U- The place still exists, as a ruin. The Asaron call it the Grave Horde. Grave Horde? Cherry name. You'll find it in the eastern mountains, buried under the tangled coils of a metal devil, or a BOR-7 Horus, rather, as we're learning to call them. I'll contact you when you get there. I can't wait. Someday we'll meet in person, and your manners had better be improved. Mm. Well, getting down will be a lot faster than you at least. Your hands would burn, for sure. Your hands would be so burnt. Forget the cold. Think of the sun on her skin. Man, yeah, shut up. I got I 
I got these. What was I trying to get? Double shot would be nice. But can I craft some like potions? Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, come on. Gonna bring you down. Don't be cat calling to your friend. Come on. I don't got all day to fight all of you. I don't even know if I can fight this many of you. I'm just trying to get this vantage point. Maybe I have to kill him over there. Oh, there it's up there. Where did it go? Well, I'm not trying to walk all that way. So... Easier when I was a kid. Oh, man. They're inside, too. Come on, I press circle. Time to take a look around the room. Yes, sir. Can't be too prepared. Yeah, pretty well, actually, that's not true, but. You can most definitely be too prepared. Operation during victory. All right. What did that mean? Well, before Whatever I go in was, there, I think this is gonna well. actually do it for this stream, just because I have stuff to do. But uh, yeah, we'll start up a, another one next time.